Real estate market update for the beginning of 2022 for all of the homeowners and future home buyers throughout our region. Things have changed quite a bit, but much has stayed the same. What's changed? Real estate sales actually went down in 2021. They're down 2%. So the number of homes that are selling month after month is, are fewer and fewer. And why is that? Well, we had a lot of inventory problems. Inventory continued to drop throughout the entire year. So if you went to the store and you were gonna go buy something and there was nothing on the shelves, that's a pretty good analogy considering a lot of people went to the grocery store and they couldn't find what they needed. You can't buy it. Same thing happened with buyers. There was really low inventory. There was nothing to buy. That cost sales to go down 2%. But something happened. Inventory actually started to rise compared to 2020, and it went up 81%. So inventory is up 81%. Now we still don't have enough inventory, but it's it's rising. It's rising. So home home buyers, that's good news for you. Home sellers, that's not good news for you. Now it's still an extreme sellers market. So home homeowners are seeing home appreciation, but it's starting to change. Home appreciation went up 21% in 2021. 21% because of, because of the low inventory. Now, will that continue? Probably not because inventory is rising and so that 21% is gonna go down. It's gonna to continue to go down. So that's what's going on in the real estate marketplace. If you're a home buyer, be active because homes are coming on the marketplace. They're still selling quickly, but you can still get them. Interest rates went up from 2.8 to 3.5%. So interest rates are still really low historically, but they're more than they were before. Will that continue? Probably, I don't know, we'll see. We're gonna make five bold predictions in another video, so stay tuned for that. That's the real estate market update for the beginning of 2022.